I think of home, I think about family, safety, being around my friends. I don't remember anything that I have from Yemen except the idea of me playing music. The thing is, if I go back, am I gonna play or not? If I go back, am I really home? That's the question I ask myself. I wish I could. basically my relationship with my country and how I feel about it because it's more like a love story okay. of two people stuck in a toxic relationship kind oh, of cool. and they're trying to break a cycle but uh -huh. they both love each other and but oh yeah. yeah I know about that yeah it's a beautiful concept <laughs> it's really good I can't wait to can we can we like hear a little bit you got to pull up right now yeah but I go where you go survivor Chilling with yeah. our friends, they usually come over and we stay, and we were most of the time listening to ex ambassadors. Jesus. Obviously, we grew up in very, very different environments, but I remember wanting to leave my town desperately yeah. when I was a kid. I keep coming back to it. It's in my music. I think it's cool to also to say, but I go where you go. Yeah. I realized that if I want to keep doing something I love, I need to leave, I need to find a way. I just took my guitar and my passport and I left. I took a boat with the Somali refugees and the Yemenis. I covered my face so I, nobody recognizes me. It was almost night. The sky was very clear. First time I actually realized how the stars are beautiful. Oh. 